But one thing at the club to really help just increase your income and make your hustle a lot easier is to make yourself look a little bit different. Make yourself stand out. <laughs> So today I'm going to talk about how I switch up my look at work to make more money and how you can do the same. So stay tuned. All right. So as we all know, the way that we look at the club definitely plays a big role in the money that we make. So the way you look is super important. So as a stripper, one of the best ways to invest in yourself and invest in your money, invest in your business, you're a sole proprietor at this club, um, is to invest in yourself in the way that you look. You know what I mean? You know, you want to be putting in effort so that you can look amazing, so that you can be making money um, easier, more effortlessly at the club. And I think that it's not just about how good you look, it's also about making sure that you stand out in a way that makes you different from everyone else and just makes everyone in the room look at you, you know, all eyes on you, everyone wants that girl, makes you stand out. So I've got a few tips that I want to talk about to change your appearance just in small ways that'll make you stand out that will have everyone in the club lining up to get dances from you. So I'm not saying going natural is bad in any kind of way. Um, people are so naturally beautiful. I see all these girls are so freaking gorgeous all around me. But one thing at the club to really help just increase your income and make your hustle a lot easier is to make yourself look a little bit different. Make yourself stand out. So the number one way that I do this at the club for myself is by switching up my hair. Um, as you can see, this is obviously like not something you see every day. It's so freaking gorgeous. It's long as fuck. Like it's just not something you see every day. And at the club, you know, we're actually trying to fulfill a fantasy, you know, something that these men don't get to see every day or, you know, that they're going there for a good time. They want to see people that are looking like amazing. Like we are the fantasy, you know what I mean? We're the entertainment. So you want to be looking different when I have this hair. I promise that I stand out and it's not because I'm more beautiful than the other girls. It's not because of anything like that. It's literally because I look different than everyone else. And, and anytime I wear crazy hair, I literally, all of my customers, it's like the first thing they say, I love your hair. I love your hair. I love your hair. I chose it because of your hair. I've been watching you all night. I've been trying to get a dance from you all night. You know, I can make money with my natural hair. I, I can make money with a natural look. Of course I can. So can you, of course. But I noticed that when I've got <laughs> hair that makes me stand out from everyone else and just look different, I have people lining up. You know, I have a wait list. Vanessa, sorry, I've got three people ahead of you. Like, I'll get to you when I can. So having something like amazing long hair or a different color of hair or something that makes you stand out is like a huge help at making money. I literally have so many colors. You know, I like to switch it up. I've got blues. I've got, you know, pink, I've got red, <laughs> I've got rainbow, obviously, I've got green, I've got so many more colors, um, but yeah, it's just nice to be able to switch up your look, and another thing, like, just by having a different hairstyle, people might think that you're a different person, and say that you were kind of in a bad mood the night before, or you were kind of a bitch to somebody, um, <laughs> or you're kind of like a bitch to one of the customers or something and you realize that they had money but you kind of messed up your shot, guess what? Tomorrow when I come to work wearing this, I've got a whole new shot at that motherfucker, all right? Because it's a new day, new hair, new me. He, they're not gonna recognize you unless they're really on it, you know what I mean? Also another cool thing about switching up your hair color is a lot of times you can attract a different crowd than, than you usually would. It'll just open up doors to, um, people that like different things, people that are willing to spend money on you, people that are looking for something different. You know, you just widen your range of customers just by switching up your look, you know, every night coming out with something new, you're offering something new, people like different things and having that switch up every night really allows you to just have a constant flow of clientele and be able to target a whole broader range of clients. Not only that, but when you change up your look and you change up your hair and you're feeling good about yourself, you know, you'll just have that confidence boost. You'll feel like a different person. So you'll want to be that person. You know, you, you'll be able to play that role better. You'll be able to put more effort in. It'll give you more energy and more motivation to work. You know, I just find that when I look good, 
I work better. When I feel good, I work better. You know what I mean? When I know that I'm like the shit, I'm walking around like I am the shit. And people can see that. They can sense that. And they want me. You know what I mean? They, they are attracted to it. They'll line up for that. So just by changing your look, even though you might not necessarily look like better than what you looked before, it's just different. You know, it'll give you that sense of motivation, that sense of confidence, just like a new little burst of energy to try something new and just work hard for that night. So that's also a really good feeling of switching up your look. You just feel fresh, you feel clean, you know, you feel like new you and I'm ready to make a new bag. <laughs> also, another way, not just switching up your color, but the style that you wear your hair. If you um, have some cool hairstyles, I'm definitely gonna post a video about um, different hairstyles that you can use for the club. But just like the way that you do your hair, if you have funky hairstyles that are like fun, but even if you put like the top of your hair up into little ponytails or like little space buns or something like that, it's just a little different and it just makes you stand out a little bit more. Like it's the small things that just set you apart. And those are the little things you need to take into consideration that will help you just be able to make that money easier at the club. You want to just catch people's eyes, stand out. You know, when you're working with hundreds of girls, everyone's so gorgeous, but you want to just look a little bit different so that you catch customers' eyes and that they want you. Another way I like to switch up my appearance at the club to stand out is by the clothes that I wear and the outfits that I wear to my club. So this is all dependent on the club that I'm working at and the people that work at the club and the outfits that are acceptable. Um, but once you get to your club and you see what everyone's wearing and you know what's allowed and what's not allowed, you need to start wearing outfits that set you apart, you know, that make you look different than everyone around you. Even if it's something that looks really good on you, if it doesn't make you stand out, maybe don't wear it to the club because you want outfits that are going to be show-stopping, that people are going to, it's going to catch their eye and they're going to be, who is that? You know what I mean? Just, just at a glance, you know, something that makes you stand out. So. For example, if your club has really good LED lights um, or the bright light that makes everything glow, I would freaking wear neon like as much as you can because you will literally glow everywhere you go in that club and people are always going to see you. You know, I wouldn't be walking around the club with a black outfit if there was really good neon lights or really good neon lights and LED lights that are going to make you glow because you're going to just shrink in you're gonna just blend and even if you look freaking amazing in that black outfit like you're not gonna stand out you know people don't just see a black outfit and go whoa what was that you know in my opinion of course there's amazing black outfits and i'm not saying all black outfits are bad but just to make yourself look different if i want to stand out you know what i mean um i wear something bright you know i wear something that glows if you if you do want to wear black um i would wear something that's maybe like bedazzled like this uh this is just some um, netted top but something that like bedazzled stand out anything that is bedazzled is always good you know it's an extra bling it's attracting um it's it's light catching people will want to turn so anything that's blinged out also another cool thing that you can add are things like um leg sleeves or arm sleeves and these things just make you look so cool like honestly like if if you're not at a club where these are too popular, you should try it because you will literally stick out like a sore fucking thumb and people will be lining up for you. You know what I mean? Or when they have like little lace ones for your arms, I have a few like that. Um, but just adding something different that people don't see normally, they're like, whoa, what's that? You know what I mean? Like it's just this eye catching and it makes you stand out. And that's like one of the most important factors of dancing is making yourself stick out apart from the crowd and so that people want to line up for you. You know, everyone likes something and so um, any look is going to work at the club, but I feel like the best tip if you really want to maximize your profits at work is to make yourself stand out from the other girls, uh, make yourself stand out in general, really try to attain that fantasy look. I mean, of course you can make money doing the bare minimum and uh, wearing a natural face and hardly doing anything with your hair and wearing a normal lingerie. I, I, I've done it, you know what I mean? Um, but it's just like this, if you really want to be getting your best results, this is a job that gets a lot easier when you're looking freaking amazing, when you stand out and just are different. So if you're able to just make yourself stick out and different from the people around you, you know, bright colors, long hair, different hair colors, different hairstyles, 
different outfits that are not too worn in your club, um, just things that make you stand out. These are all little things that you can add in your routine just to make you stand out at the club and just make more money while you're there. Not only that, but just also increase your motivation and confidence and just make you have a second burst of wind, you know, ready to work again. Um, so just by switching up your look, I think it can benefit you in so many ways and help you make money at the club in so many ways. So give it a try. Um, you guys can use any wigs, of course. Um, I actually sell these wigs on my website. They're freaking amazing. They stay on so good. They just make you stand out. They're so long. And it's heat resistant synthetic hair. So you can straighten it and revive it. Um, and it's not too crazy expensive, not thousands of dollars for a wig that would be real hair. So it's perfect for the club. Um, but yeah, you guys can get any wigs. It doesn't have to be mine. Um, there's so many cool outfits out there. Just look for outfits that make you stand out. And just finding those little things that make you stand out and look different, I think will really boost your income at work. So try these little tips and tricks and let me know how they go. I hope that this helped. I hope that you guys like this video. And if you have any questions, leave them below and I'll get back to you. But yeah, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe for more stripper vlogs and videos. Thanks for watching. Love you guys.